So Aaron Judge today's meeting with the Giants. He will be meeting with the Dodgers soon. Does this alarm you if you're a Yankee fan? If your desire, if one of your desires for the Yankees is for Aaron Judge to come back, does this make you nervous? You guys let me know what you think down in the comments. Also, I just want to say this before we dive deeper into this. Thank you for 7,000 subscribers. I can't believe we hit it. We did. Thank you so much, guys. Without your support, whatever I'm doing on here would not be possible. So I just want to say thank you so much. Thank you for your support. I love you all. I appreciate you all. Now, let's get back to the content. Listen, does it make me nervous that Aaron Judge is going to meet with the Giants, that he's going to meet with the Dodgers? Yeah. Yeah, because I want him to come back. I want him to wear pinstripes, Yankee pinstripes again. Of course. Of course it makes me nervous. It doesn't shock me, but it makes me nervous. He could very well go to San Francisco. He could very well sign with the Dodgers. For the simple fact, he's from the West Coast. He, was, he grew up a Giants fan. Of course he's going to entertain that idea. Now, this, this might sting a little bit for Yankee fans, including myself, because we supposedly offered him a contract, and the number that's being thrown around is $337 million. And if that is true, holy crap, how much does this guy want? Does it concern me? Sure, yes, yes, it does. But what a lot of people are doing, and it's aggravating the crap out of me, seriously, what a lot of people are doing, they're comparing Judge to Jeter, and they're expecting the same thing from Judge that we got from Jeter. As Yankee fans, we were blessed. Jeter was a really good talent, number one, but he loved being a Yankee, and he grew up a freaking Yankee fan. It was his dream to wear Yankee pinstripes. It was his dream. This is what Jeter wanted to do. So to say that Judge isn't like Jeter, you were 100% right. He's not. Judge grew up watching Barry Bonds launch home runs into McCovey Cove. That's what he did. So the, the fantasy of him hitting home runs the other way into McCovey Cove launching them into the freaking glove in left field, that's appetizing to him. That would be great. I guarantee you it is. But the one thing that the Yankees have over, over the Giants is that the Yankees are in a better spot to win. The Giants, if they're winning over 100 games in 2021, finished 30 games behind first place and just cracked 500 is that where judge wants to go sure if they were to sign him that should you build around of course <laughs> but then you have reports that the giants might not be willing to invest all their money into judge and rather spread it around so will the Giants just be used to drive up the price for the Yankees to, to offer him a richer contract? Who knows? Very well could be. This doesn't shock me. It does concern me. And I don't think he would go to the Dodgers. I have my reasons, but I don't think he would go. They could offer him a contract that blows his socks off, and then he might go. But realistically, I personally don't think he goes there. But you guys, let me know what you think about everything I said in this video. Do you think, are you nervous? Does this make you concerned? Are you nervous? Are you scared? Do you want to cry if Aaron Judge signs with San Francisco, with LA? Let me know what you guys think. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Thank you for seven, I almost said eight, for 7,000 subscribers. I guess 8,000 is the next number, so I'm excited for that, I guess. So listen, thank you so much, guys. This is Joan. Until next time, signing out.